Lipids are fat polymers made of hydrocarbons. Lipids have the easiest structure to remember because they are just long chains of carbons with hydrogen atoms. Because of its symmetric and balanced structure, they are nonpolar molecules. As we mentioned in the water video, water does not dissolve nonpolar molecules, so we can also say that lipids are hydrophobic. Hydro means water, and phobic means fear of, so together this word means fear of water or water fearing. So that, in other words, means fats don't mix well with water. That's why if you ever put water and oil together in a bottle, they naturally separate into two layers. The three most common forms of lipids in the body are triglycerides, phospholipids, and cholesterols. Triglycerides are made of three lipid polymers called fatty acids that are all attached to one glycerol molecule that is shown right here. That's why they're called tri-3-glycerides. Most of the fats that you eat in your diet are in the forms of triglycerides, and your body also stores fats in the form of triglycerides. Phospholipids have two fatty acids plus a phosphate group all attached to the glycerol. Just remember, phospho refers to the phosphate group and lipid refers to the two fatty acids. The phosphate group is polar, so it's hydrophilic and interacts well with water. Philic means love of, so together hydrophilic means love of water or water loving. Even though the phosphate group is hydrophilic, the lipids are still hydrophobic. So phospholipids are hydrophilic on one side and hydrophobic on the other side. This characteristic is incredibly useful. Phospholipids are frequently represented like this, with this as the phosphate group and then two lipids, or two fatty acids rather, drawn like that. Um, they can form double layers, and double layers are sometimes drawn like this. So that's one layer, and then this would be the double layer. These phospholipid bilayers surround all cells and cell organelles to form membranes, and they also give these membranes many of its unique properties. This will be explained in another video. Lastly, cholesterol is a unique lipid, not made of chains, but made of rings of hydrocarbons. There are three hexagon rings and one pentagon ring with a little doohickey off the pentagon. Cholesterol is only found in animal cells, generally embedded in the cell membrane. All of the steroid hormones in the body are derived from cholesterol, like estrogen, testosterone, and progesterone.